Dee Haynes here, and welcome to Pretty PR Chick TV. So, as you can tell by the title, we are going to be unboxing my brand new MacBook. So, my birthday was three days ago, um, and this was one of my main gifts. I really, really wanted a MacBook. Um, I have been, like, debating about getting one for, like, a year, over a year. I saved up some money a couple of times and I ended up spending the money that I saved up from when I spent it on like trips and handbags. Um, but I was like, okay, 2020, you gotta buy a MacBook. So um, basically, my parents gifted me half of the money for my birthday. So um, and I paid the other half. So it was a pretty nice gift. Um, so it is inside this box right here. Um, I was not able to get it from the Apple store. So I had to order it over the phone with an Apple sales rep um, because the Apple store where I live here in Buffalo is open again but they did not have um, a laptop with all of the specs that I wanted but Ooh, it's really taped up um, but it was a pretty easy process I just talked to um, a business sales rep on the phone and he went over like every single thing I might possibly need it for went over YouTube video editing photo editing all types of stuff um, and he helped me basically design my laptop so da -da -da -da. there it is I'm so excited please don't mind the glare from the ring light Oh, I'm so excited. Oh, okay, let's bust this bad boy open. Okay, I got my handy dandy scissors. Oh, I actually don't need them. I'll just pull this off. Alright, so FYI, this is my first MacBook. Up until this point, I've only had PCs. I know I have been missing out in life but um i do have an ipad pro um which when i bought it they convinced me oh it's just as good as a macbook it's just smaller it does everything it really doesn't but um i do like it for what it's worth but i wish i would have invested in a macbook before um but yeah we're gonna open it up Ooh, got the box Here's what it looks like. So I got the 16 inch in silver. It smells so new. <laughs> and also inside the box, just a little warranty, I guess, and probably the care instructions the power cord, and then the big block adapter. Alright, so I'm going to plug this guy in and then I'm going to tell you the specs um, for all the upgrades. So, let's see. Alright guys, so here are the specs for my MacBook Pro. Um, first off, I obviously selected the 16 inch and the color I chose was silver um, and then on to the upgrades so I chose the 2.3 gigahertz 8 core 9th generation Intel Core i9 processor with turbo boost up to 4.8 gigs um, then I upgraded the memory to 32 gigs as for the graphics, I upgraded to the 8 gigs of memory, and then I left the storage at 1 terabyte of storage. I also um, installed Final Cut Pro X, and those were all of the upgrades that I made to the actual laptop. The last thing I did was, of course, add on Apple Care. Okay, you guys can see, now I need to... Um, select my country, United States. Mm -hmm. 
And my apologies guys, but the final clip that like shows the finished setup of my laptop is somehow lost. So we're going to move on to the accessories. Okay, so I made an Amazon wish list for my birthday. Um, and a number of the items that I put on my wish list were MacBook related since I knew my computer was coming. Um, it actually was not supposed to arrive until July 9th. I think I ordered it on like June 27th, but it ended up arriving on July 3rd. So I was super happy about that. Um, it shipped from China and it literally only took three days from the time that they shipped it to arrive at my house. So, all right, so the first thing I got was actually the accessory I ordered from Apple. This is the Satechi, Satechi? Um, USB-C multi-part pro so this thing cost $64.95 uh, purchasing it through Apple I am not sure if I'm gonna keep this because I ended up ordering or adding um, something very similar on my Amazon wish list so now I have two of them so this one um, has a USB-A port um, USB-C PD 4k HDMI SD and micro SD ports and it just plugs in into the side I'm not gonna open it up because I kind of think I'm gonna return this one um, but then I end up ordering uh, adding this one to my Amazon wish list and someone purchased it for me so thank you um, and this is a uh, USB-C TV3 hub a 7-in-1 so I will list all of these in the description. The company is, I have no idea how you pronounce this, Z-M-U-I-P-N-G. So, um, this one, I believe, has all of the same ports. It was a lot cheaper. I think it was like $28. Um, but it has a Thunderbolt 3 port, a USB-C. Um, it has the SD and micro SD slots. Um... USB 3.0, it has two of those, and then it has like the double um, prongs right here to plug into your computer and it won't hang off. I actually like this one better because I travel a lot. Whenever the world open, opens back up and I start traveling again, I think that this would be simpler to just stick in the side of my laptop and not have like a cord hanging off. Um, so yeah, and then there's a USB at the end over here. Okay, next up, I got a laptop case. And of course, it's cute and glittery. Hopefully, it fits perfectly. We're going to try it out. So, I picked this rose gold glitter color. And the bottom is just like kind of clear plastic and that's what it looks like um, it seems to be pretty snug I don't hear any wiggling or anything um, and I think it just looks really cute and really glam and very girly and then I also needed a sleeve to stick this guy in so I picked this marble design um it's like white and pink marble with little like i thought they were rose gold um lines running through it but it's really kind of just like i don't know faded gold but the reason i picked this is because it matches my phone case which i also got from amazon and my um airpod case also looks like that so it has a little pocket on the side where you can stick your um, charger and anything else you need. Ooh, it's kind of like micro suede on the inside and you can feel like some really thick padding. And it fits inside perfectly. It zips up pretty snug. So, feels pretty protected. Now I also got this cord, um, this is actually a repurchase for me. This is just a camera cord, um, 
to connect to my Canon camera. I actually misplaced my cord. It's probably somewhere in my apartment, but I cannot find it. And because I want to um, use my camera connected to my MacBook in future videos, I needed to get a replacement cord. So I got that guy. Then I needed a mouse. So I got this little um, wireless Bluetooth mouse. It is also rose gold because I'm very matchy matchy. And it came with a little um, charging cord. And I think this is the last thing that I got. And this is a laptop stand. So I figured that this will probably take up a bunch of room on my desk. I use this desk to do my work, but I also use this desk to do my makeup. So I don't want my laptop to take up a ton of room. Um, so basically it just looks like this, as you can see, it's really small. That's too small for my laptop, but it came with an Allen wrench and on the bottom, there are like four little Allen wrench screws. You can loosen them like this. So you just loosen it up and then you can adjust it to your desired size and then my laptop will just sit in here cradled like this when I'm not using it and I can also use it that way to dock it and connect it to my monitor. This quick update so I actually got a few more items after I filmed this video so I figured I would just insert this clip here. So first off um, I got a keyboard cover and this, <laughs> let me turn it right side up, um, is a keyboard skin with the Final Cut Pro um shortcuts on it because i'd like to learn final cut pro so i figured that this would be um easier for me and then i got a um a little laptop cleaner so it has this little swipe up brush on one side um and then this little like soft side on the opposite end i also got a screen protector and then I got this giant mouse pad. It's about two feet long, but I wanted it to go like the span of my desk so I can put my mouse anywhere and like sit my computer and stuff on top of it. And uh, yeah, so that's everything else that I got. Um, if you guys are MacBook experts or you know other things that you think that I need, please let me know. Um, I already have a couple of external hard drives, so I didn't need to purchase that. Um, I may at some point need to get a larger one, so I may get one and upgrade, but you know, all in all, I'm very happy with my purchase so far. I'm going to play around on this bad boy and kind of customize it tonight. And yeah, that's about it. So if you have any questions, please leave them below in the comments and I'll do my best to answer. And I appreciate you guys so much for watching this video and I will see you in the next one. Peace out.